in South Texas, there's two programs that have known each other, that know each other pretty well. Shiner and Refurio meeting for the sixth time in the last five seasons. Uh, and they have always played some classics. It's been a back and forth affair between these two decorated programs. Two teams that are no stranger to the big stage. They met up again one more time in San Marcos on Friday. Let's go to the action. Shiner on the op following an opening kick return, uh, or rather fo following a Shiner touchdown, Isaiah Bland says, I've got an answer for you. It's a kickoff return for a touchdown, and Refurio is going to tie this game up at seven. Then late in the second, this is Ryan Peterson for, to Kyle Muelstein. Going to roll, find Kyle Muelstein for a 13-yard touchdown. 14-13, Shiner had the lead in the half. Into the third corner, Shiner's ball. Trace Bishop, touchdown run here off the right side. And Shiner's up 21-13. Now into the fourth, Jordan King is going to get the handoff for Refurio. Punch it in. They don't get a two-point conversion. That's going to keep it 21-19. Now late in the fourth, fourth and 12. Deep in Shiner territory for Refurio. They decide to go for it. Isaiah Avery is going to haul it in from Keelan Brown. Break of tackle. Go 87 yards. Fourth in the season, and they come up with the miracle. Refurio wins it. 27 to 21 in an unbelievable new addition to this outstanding rivalry. Our Sarah Merrifield was there to capture it for the Jack in the Box Spotlight. Since 2019, the game between Shiner and Refurio in postseason play, the winner of that game has gone on to win state. However, this is the first year in that same amount of time where these two schools have played a precursor game in district. Refurio won 38-27 just a few weeks ago, but Friday night's game was the game that mattered. Um, I, I tell you what, Shiner came to play tonight. The, the, the game we played them in district was a war. It was a lot different than this game, but it was a war. It came down to one or two plays, but... For our kids on fourth and 17, backed up from their own end zone to com to complete that ball and then score is just, I mean, words can't express how proud I am of the kids. Team I'm effort. So grateful great, to still be alive. Great, great, great job. Let's enjoy job it. Did. And then let's. Yeah, it's, it's great. It's two great programs with great tradition, great coaching, and great athletes. Uh, and both both teams want it really bad. We want we beat them in 19, went on to win it. They beat us the last two years, went on to win it. So hopefully we'll just keep the pattern going. The last time Refurio walked onto the state championship stage was in 2019. And for this group of Bobcats, they're just one hurdle away from achieving that goal again.